This is my homeless home. It's a commercial building in Maryland. Nobody else lives here, just myself. And in May of last year, I became homeless when I no longer had the resources to pay for my rent in my apartment, also here in Maryland. This is my room. I'm literate. I'm self-educated. I can design websites. I'm a very good photographer. Um, an artist. I have many skills. But due to a lack of resources, specifically, I was unable to pay my own rent and make my own way. And so in May of last year, I became homeless. Um, there are many of us, many people like us in the world, and it's a hard way to go. I lived in my car a lot of the time. I um, <clears throat> with my dog. And uh, it was just, just really barbaric way to live. Um, and very cold and very isolated and um, I don't even know how I managed. Um, after a time I got a place to live, um, it didn't work out, um, just didn't get along with my roommates and I, I wasn't really paying rent anyways so there's not really any real reason to keep me around and now I'm living in my art studio. Um, they know I'm here um, and they've been most gracious in allowing me to stay. I'm a veteran and I have a, a grant coming that will pay my rent for the remainder of my life actually um, because I'm a chronically homeless veteran and they want to end that for me. Um, and uh, I am so elated. I can't even believe uh, what that might, what that's actually going to feel like to move into a place and know that I will never have to leave it or that my rent will always be paid no matter what. And that is such a blessing. Um, and that's supposed to start coming together this week, actually. And I wanted to do a video uh, while I'm still homeless. I wanted to talk about it. And some of you already know that I do um, advocacy work and uh, activist work with an online website called friendtothehomeless.org. And uh, I educate people through my own experiences um, on what it's like to be homeless in hopes that it will bring compassion and with compassion, uh, chance for change. Um, there's a lot of homeless people in this in this world, and we need to be recognized as human beings and uh, reached out to, for sure. We have a lot to offer. Uh, we're creative individuals, unique individuals, and we we really need to be. Uh, recognized. What I recommend I doing is finding a way to connect with homeless people, whether it be through friendtothehomeless.org or some other way, um, and just try to find some compassion in yourself for them and reach out in some way and volunteer or or on your own doing care packages or socks only would be fine. 
but do some outreach, some kind of outreach. We have value. We have value. Thank you for watching.